DPP has promised to make the Gulf Coast whole again, and today they hope to restore some confidence in the seafood industry. One of the oil giant's top officials visited Bayou La Battery this afternoon to eat fresh local seafood. But there's just one problem. The seafood was not exactly local. News 5's Jessica Taloni joins us with a story you will only see right here on News 5. Jessica? Well, Roseanne, BP officials set out today to show Gulf seafood is safe, but at least part of their message got lost in a little mix-up. One of BP's top officials is putting his message where his mouth is. Or is he? In an effort to show Gulf seafood is safe, Chief Operating Officer Mike Utzler enjoyed a seafood spread from the Lighthouse Restaurant in Bayou La Battery. The seafood in the Gulf of Mexico has, is the most tested seafood. It is safe. It is sound. I eat it everywhere I go almost every day. But the media event, which included a tour of a local processing facility, may do little to quash the concerns of those skeptical of the fresh catch. When News 5 asked the restaurant where today's lunch came from, here's what they told us. The crab claws, while bought from a local distributor, were shipped in from Baltimore, Maryland. The mullet was caught in Florida. The oysters from Texas and Florida. And the shrimp, though it is local, was caught before the oil spill frozen and served up daily. Because nobody knows what the long-term effects are going to be. So if you have stuff that's from before the spill, you know it's good or as good as it ever was. So that's what you'd want to be eating. The restaurant tells us they don't know when they'll start bringing in local post-oil spill products. And they say BP never asked where their seafood came from. Still, BP insists their purpose is the same restoring confidence in Gulf Coast seafood. BP has been here since the beginning to say that we would make it right, to work hard, to be a part of making it right. Even if this event fell a few shrimps short of a cocktail.